Greetings, viewers. How is 2021 treating you so far? I am Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, and I've been doing a lot of GTA San Andreas walkthrough videos. A while back, I posted some videos on how to steal a Patriot vehicle. The first one was from the Easter Basin Army military facility, which usually ends up in tragedy because you have a five star wanted level and you get chopped up pretty quickly and the thing goes up in flames. And if you're lucky, you escape. Well, then the other one I showed is how to easily steal a Patriot that is parked at the Easter Bay Chemical Processing Facility. Uh, you don't get the five-star wanted level, and you get to export the vehicle and then buy it for $32,000. Well, one of the things I found in GTA San Andreas was, hey, you can steal a tank really easily. And I'm going to show you how to do that in this video. This takes place after you have stolen the jetpack because it makes it real easy to steal a tank. And if you try and do it using an airplane and skydiving, you're going to get shot down and shot up real quick. So the secret is. To get up close to the wall of the army base, um, it's surprising that they do not set up a five-star wanted level and shoot at you at this point. Well, what you do is you hop over the fence real quick and you run to the tank and get into the tank and you're pretty much invulnerable and it's going to be a lot of fun you can shoot stuff up and you don't go the way i'm going because the exit is in the opposite direction and these barriers are pretty solid but i'm going to let this play out and you can see the type of fun you can have stealing a tank Once you get the tank out of the military base, you want to bring it to Verdant Meadows, your airfield, and park it in the hangar. Because, yes, it might fit into the garage. Well, I kind of know it does. But once you're out of the tank, you're going to have to arm up with the M4 and take down some uh, FBI... Uh, FIB, whatever they call them, bad guys, well, you're going to just run to the hangar, abandoned uh, tower, and save because that erases your wanted level and brings up your health to 100%. And now you can go out and see if you've got the tank, which you should have. And... First, I'm going to go get the body armor for CJ, 
And that is all the way over by the third airplane on the map here. Once you hit the third airplane, you run back to the wreckage here. And again, grab the body armor. It's free body armor. And then run back to the hangar to see if the tank is there. Awesome, the tank is there and you get a bonus vehicle. That's what happens when they chase you into the hangar. So I'm gonna take this uh, nice shiny, uh, what is it called, an FBI rancher. And I'm gonna park it in my garage over here so that I can have this vehicle as well. And the garage over at Verdant Meadows holds a surprisingly large number of vehicles and I'm going to show you right away. Uh, inside this garage I already have a police car, a Sanchez, and a police motorbike. The Sanchez I probably could export at Easter Base and Docks, but nah, it's a good little vehicle to ride. I'm going to move the police. Uh, motorcycle here and I'm going to park this FBI rancher and yes your tank probably could fit into this garage but why bother you got a hangar for that and now I'm going to move the motorcycles back and like I said it can fit a surprisingly large number of vehicles and you can store them and they will remain there. At some point, maybe I'll show you again. But, hey, you got a free bonus FBI rancher while stealing a tank. And I'm going to save just to make sure. And once I save, well, hey, you've got these vehicles. Let's pop out here. And, well... There you go. They still are there. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, reminding you to smash the like button if you like this type of video or like this video. And if you like this type of video, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon for notification. As always, thanks for stopping by.